Hey then guys, welcome back and thank you to you for tuning in to another review. This will be video number 13 and today we have got for you the, was it two, the Geek Vape Medusa RDTA. So you can zoom in by there. Now this just looks very, very pretty. Let me try and, there we go. You see it properly but there look the medusa and you got all like the like the snaky type of engraving on there we go look looks absolutely beautiful and you've got the two airflows you got two over there on the one side 180 degrees that way you got another two you got the yellow drip tip on the top in there is a 2.8 mil tank capacity You've got the velocity style posts to build it on top of. Let me show you that there. Let's try and get in close. There we go. If you can see that properly. There we are. You've got the velocity style decks. You've got ample space to build around in by there. And we will be getting down into a close up in just a second, guys. So I can show you the contents of the box. I'm going to be doing a little build tutorial deal, but I'm going to speed up the build a little bit so it's not so long of a video. You'll have a bit of music playing in the background also. Um, in the box with this, which I find is pretty good, better than 90% of the packagings that you get and the contents that you get in most devices. But in this one, look, they've added a little orange three-way Allen key. Now I love that, and you get plenty of O-rings, obviously, and you get your screws. It's a Philip, Philip screw down on top of, those well, the Allen key screw downs on this. I'm getting Philips from my other RD, which I've been building on today. But absolutely, so easy to build on with the Velocity style decks. They are one of the easiest posts and style decks that you can build on. I do recommend Velocities for beginners and so on um now let me take a quick bit of this view inside you at the moment i'm going to strip it down and do a fresh build for you but at the moment i've got nie 24 gauge uh seven eight wraps dual coil coming in at 0.17 now let me take a quick bit for you Now it isn't all down to the depth that I've got, uh, the coils that I've got built inside of this that's giving me the vapor protection and the flavor. It's all to do with the deck, the posts, the air holes, the shape of the of the device on its own, the how short the chimney is. It's all it's all got a part to play in how the device works. Now when we get down into the close-ups and we come back up into my final thoughts. I'll tell you exactly what I think about the device. Now, without further ado, let's go down below and get down into those close-ups. Hi, Jordan, guys. Here we are down in the close-ups. We'll, I'll talk you through it before I get into the build, fast up the speed and into doing a new build for you but i just want to strip this down and show you exactly what comes with this device now there of course is your top and you can screw the drip tip out like so now i like this because in this it's a 510 drip tip adapter also you can so you can put any old 510 drip tip that you've got or you might like to use in there slot in perfectly now let's get down to the deck now you can't quite see it let me zoom in see if we can get a good view now you can't quite see it but in here you've got like a lock picture let me see if i can get it for you where's it by 
it's this side it is no you can't you can't quite make it out but for there you've got an arrow on the center part of the device there and it's arrowing down to a lock which you can turn this center part and then it goes across turn it to be there to the unlock part let me show you just get it over there let me take unscrew this so i can show you exactly what i mean now let's unscrew that there and you unscrew that get the arrow to face the unlock which is right there and it just pops off you see and let me get this off and if you have a look there you got the velocity style deck there we go there's a hexagonal screws in the sides now if you have a look down in there you see the gap in the deck that is where your 2.8 mil of juice capacity is so you pour your juice down into the sides down in there and then this then when you're ready to go you just pop it back on top and then it goes to the unlock part there and you just push it down and then turn it and it locks so that doesn't move then that is stuck in place now you can obviously in the four holes where the cut where the whip legs go the cotton legs you can drip down into the but i recommend you take the center piece off and drip that way much easier much less mess you don't get juice everywhere so what i'm going to do now i'm going to strip this down for you we'll do this in real time so you can see how it's done but then the rebuild is going to be in quick time so the video is not so long but i, I love love building on a velocity style posts and deck it is so easy i do recommend velocities to uh, a beginner on building because it is just so easy really easy and a hell of a lot of space to work with and again on this deck there's a lot of space to work with so you don't see like i've done by there i haven't got the coils really close to the posts because you don't need to do it see they're quite far away it's nearly done just unscrew this last one and pull the coil out there you go and that is your deck that is what you build on zoom in a bit but they get a better view there we go and there it is the posts the velocity style and there's the deck there's your juice well 2.8 mil capacity so there we go guys now the next step we're going to do we're going to be putting a fresh build on it oh and uh i will be doing it in a fast time we'll have a bit of music in the background just to keep you guys occupied as you're watching it and then we will come back on top for my final thoughts on the device
right there here we go back up on top right now you see that build i did it in quick time for you so the video ain't gonna be too dragging on we're just building or whatever if you guys do want to see a real time uh build of this device then please put it in the comments and i will surely do one for you i've done this so my videos don't last too long so pe viewers are still interested in a kind of a way so there we go you've seen the build that i put on this it's omen in 0.15 it was a seven seven wrap dual coil ni ni80 wire 24 gauge now i shall take a vape of this bad boy now without the 510 510 drip tip i'll just do it with the drip tip that it comes with i've got the airflows fully opened which is where i like them you can close them up for a bit more flavor but with this device you really really do not need any more flavor absolutely stunning on honestly i will not lie to you guys as you've seen in my previous reviews i'm as honest as they come if i don't like a device i will say i do not like it but with this it is getting the biggest thumbs up on a review that i have done so far the flavor on this is absolutely spectacular really really good and the, the vapor production is there for days now i know i've got a point point z point one five ohm coil on here but it isn't down to the to the the build deck that you've got in the device it's the way the device is made with the air holes are the sushi how close the chimney is to the deck all comes hand in hand on the proof on the performance of the device and as you listen now i mean look how clean that airflow is really really clean swooshy it's just there and i'll take a bit of it for you i mean flavor now let me turn the wattage up a little bit i've still got that down on the on, what, on my 61 i'm gonna put it up to 80 watt i think that's perfect for me 80 watt absolutely fine i don't need any more And there it is wow flavor vapor all there this device is 22 pounds 95 pence from vaponology get on over to them guys and get yourself one you cannot go wrong for that device at that price plus if you're an approved vendors member av5 off discount code for five percent of checkout honest to god please this is my highest recommendation so far my highest thumbs up get over there and get yourself one now i'll also pop in my custom made drip tip 510 drip tip into the top there and you look how beautiful that looks now the specs on this device also you come in stainless steel and black i went for the black version obviously wow oh my god absolutely stunning now the diameter of this device is 25 millimeter the height on it is 31 millimeters it's a 2.8 mil tank capacity now i will pop onto the website here while we're here and i'll tell you the specs exactly as they are on the vapenology website so let me just type it in vape analogy there it is now do, 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 do. search for product the medusa rdta right so the medusa rdta is 24 pounds 49 pence and it medusa is one of the best creations by geek vape it is a new generation rdta with a simplified inner and it's i i, I tell you what, really really 
really, really good. Now, did it do? Let me just click into the device. Now, in this, the parameters, the drip tip height is 10 millimeters. The height of the tank is 38 millimeters. The diameter of the tank is 25 millimeters. Capacity of the tank is 3 mil, it says on here. But in, in actual figures, it is 2.8 mil. Now, it comes with one Geek Vape Medusa RDTA. Simple packaging, customary packaging from the factory. The package is subject to change without notice. Features, innovative drip fill system. Makes build and refill easier than ever. Adjustable side airflow de delivers the perfect flavor. Short shaft section to increase flavor, as I said in my review. Uh, and there we go, guys. Absolutely fantastic with the velocity style posts also. Let's just clip off of that. Now, there we go. We're back. Now, final thoughts on this. To, if I could put my feet up as well and give you a thumbs up with my big toes, I would. Because it is absolutely brilliant. This is in my... I can't, I can't separate this from my other favourite RDTA. This is joint first position. Out of all my, out all my time in vaping, all my experience with different RDTAs, this tops it. This is the best one along with the second one absolutely fantastic so get yourself over to vape Monology before may 20th 2017 and get yourself one because they won't be for sale after that unfortunately due to the tvd co compliancy laws coming into effect but definitely worth the dollar 20 23 pounds 99 95 pence brilliant with av5 off at checkout get yourself over vape Monology, where they buy they buy you vapemonology.co.uk brilliant guys and uh, vapemonology of course are my sponsors so thanks for watching guys this has been video number 13 and I shall see you on the next one ah! Please subscribe to Welsh Vapesters, like and share the video.